Hi, I'm Sarah Nelson, and my summer pick is Euphoria by Lily King. Um, when I tell you that this is a book that's based on the life of anthropologist Margaret Mead, you might not expect it to be quite as racy as it is and quite as much fun as it is. It's very brainy, but it's about uh, the anthropologist and her husband and some love interests that she meets uh, along the way when she's studying natives. Very steamy book, uh, very smart book. Uh, I'm John Foro. Uh, my pick is Good Hunting by Jack Devine. Uh, who spent more than 30 years in the CIA. Uh, ultimately, he was responsible for all of their spying operations. He oversaw Charlie Wilson's war against the Soviets in Afghanistan. He was wrapped up uh, more than his liking in Iran-Contra, and he tangled with some of the uh, more infamous double agents in the CIA. It's an unwhitewashed account of his time there. It's got the good, the bad, and the ugly. Uh, it's a true spy story. It reads like Le Carre. Hi, I'm Kevin Wen, and my summer reading pick is The Fever by Megan Abbott. I'm a big fan of Megan Abbott's mysteries, uh, but I think this might be her best work. Uh, she really nails the social dynamics of high school girls, and with this book there's an added level of paranoia as this small town is trying to figure out why these high school girls are getting sick. Is it a virus? Is it a coincidence? Is it something more sinister? Uh, you'll just have to find out by reading it. My name's Chris Schloop, and my summer read is Mr. Mercedes by Stephen King. This is a book about an aging ex-cop who's uh, matching wits against a psychotic killer. And uh, as usual, King gets you right into the minds of all his characters. It's a great summer read. Um, just sit back, relax, and uh, put yourself in the hands of a great storyteller. I'm Mari Malcolm, and uh, my summer reading pick is the new Diana Gabaldon, um, the, new, the eighth book in the Outlander series, written in my own heart's blood. And um, Claire Randall, um, ex-World War II combat nurse, um, disappears into a stone circle in the Scottish Highlands and um, finds herself in the 1700s, um, where she meets the dashing Scott, um, Jamie Fraser. And really, the reason to read the series is to fall in love with Jamie. Hi, I'm Robin Rothman, and my summer pick is Half a King by Joe Abercrombie. It's an action-adventure fantasy tale coming of age about a young prince who becomes a reluctant king after his father and his brother are murdered. He embarks on a life-changing journey as a result. Um, it's aimed for young adult, but it's actually very good for adults as well. It's kind of a Game of Thrones light. It's even got a quote from George R. R. Martin on the cover. Uh, it's quick, it's fun, it's exciting, and I really recommend it for beach reading and beyond this summer. Hi, I'm Sarah Wilson, and my children's book pick for summer is The Glass Sentence. This is the first book in the new Mapmakers trilogy, and it's set in this amazingly rich world that Essie Grove has created, where all of the continents are now in different time periods, and Boston's most famous map maker has been kidnapped. Two young explorers have to set out to find him, and along the way they encounter magic, danger, adventure. This is the perfect book to start if you're looking for a new series to get a young reader hooked on. My summer reading pick for teens is The Truth About Alice, and this is the small story set in a small Texas town of what happens when an ugly rumor takes on a life of its own. It's told from multiple narrators who expose how far people are willing to go to be liked, to stay in the in crowd, even if it means going with a lie when they know the truth. Hi, I'm Neil Thompson. I'm looking forward to Daniel Silva's The Heist. I have to confess, I have a little bit of a man crush on Silva's creation, uh, Gabriel Alan, who is his um, sort of arty, hipster, multilingual, world-traveling uh, Israeli spy, art restorer, and assassin um, in the heist. He is on the prowl for the, um, the person who stole a missing Caravaggio painting. I really enjoyed Silva's last novel, The English Girl. Uh, the heist, I think, is his 14th novel featuring Gabriel Alan. Um, and I think it keeps getting better with, with each of these Gabrielle Long novels, and I think you'll like it too.